probably saw this in the warm-up. She's been working on this all week. Hello, uh, my name is Sean, and today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about uh, a buddy of mine who string sticks burned by lax. Uh, so, I've been playing lacrosse, quick background, I've been playing lacrosse since I was six years old, so that's been 31 years playing lacrosse. I grew up on the East Coast in Maryland, lacrosse is huge there, uh, played all the way uh, up through high school. Uh, high school was uh, all-star, all uh, county all-star, I also played for under 15 US, USA exchange program. Uh, started off playing MIDI, and then converted to attack. I'm a left-handed attackman, and been playing attack for quite some time. I still play to this day, and just uh, started playing more competitively, again, as of recent, uh, on a open men's team. So, anyways, to that point, it took a couple years hiatus. I was moving around. I now live in Montana, obviously. So, I uh, found the lacrosse program here for, for men and uh, was able to, uh, to join. Um, and I had the luxury of playing with these, this great group of guys uh, in, in a pretty competitive tournament with a bunch of college club teams uh, just a, a couple weekends ago. So uh, I needed to update my gear. Uh, I, I was using, at the time, an older Excalibur, not this particular one with traditional stringing. I had one with mesh as well. Um, but I always use this throughout high school. Excalibur in the late mid to late 90s is pretty much the standard of lacrosse stick equipment. Uh, it was one of the lightest, one of the strongest, and as far as feel goes, SEX has always had very good plastic, a little bit softer than some of the other brands out there in the market. So as an attackman, I think, I believe, for me, you can feel the ball better. So I have always personally gravitated towards XTX. So in, in doing some research to get a more modern head um, to update my equipment. I ran across uh, a Burn by Lax on eBay. Uh, so he actually had the Maryland flag in his, his company logo, so that prompted me to ask him some questions. We got to talking actually through Facebook Messenger, and coincidentally, he and I actually uh, played against each other in high school, which is lacrosse is a small world, so that was kind of cool. Uh, but so what he recommended to me, and I told him what I wanted, said, hey, I want a modern head. I've always used Excaliburs, absolutely love them. I see there's no newer Excalibur from STX. Uh, they come out, they have an X10 that came out a couple of years ago, uh, but I was having trouble finding them online. And right now, I believe they only offer, in 2016, they only offer a female version of the Excalibur. So, uh, what he recommended to me was this particular stick. So this is a professor. Uh, so, Professor are, are uh, NCA legal only. This one uh, is a brand new head, but it was a few seasons old. Um, doesn't matter to me. And uh, to be honest with you, I think that's a common mistake in equipment nowadays. Uh, you know, you see kids wanting the new head every year, kind of like Jordans or something. And if it's new and if it's the same make and everything, unless something revolutionary happens, like they start making professors in carbon fiber or something crazy like that. There's zero harm in uh, getting one that it's uh, brand new, but maybe a season or two old. It's the exact same stick and you probably save a bunch of money. So uh, for instance here, this professor normally costs $99. I actually got it strong in everything uh, from Burned by Lax for significantly less than that. So uh, also with the professor, you can see the difference here in head. So I'll show you the difference in head, a modern head versus a late mid to late 90s head. You can see how much more narrow the, uh, the channel is for the ball to come out. And that was really my rationale for getting a new stick. So it keeps the ball in the channel here. I mean, you barely need the cradle. You can see how tight the ball is inside the stick. And as an attackman, that makes a huge difference uh, because when you're running through stick checks and such, or, or you're dodging, it's nice to have a ball safely secured uh, inside of this inside a stick because it allows you to progress farther uh, through those type of things. So, got the head, and he asked me what I wanted. I said I wanted a Maryland stringy job. So this is what it came up with: Maryland flag themed stringy job. I love it. I think it's awesome. So, uh, and he uh, asked me a bunch of questions along the way, and this came out unbelievable. So if you're unfamiliar with this color scheme, it is the uh, Maryland State flag. And uh, 
I absolutely love it. I get compliments on it all the time and uh, it, I couldn't be any happier. So, being that this is an NCAA legal only head uh, because of the channel width, uh, I got a little nervous. I had some teammates mentioning to me in the upcoming tournament that I may not be able to use this brand new professor. So I was talking to Burned again and uh, he overnighted me this uh, superpower. So strung it the exact same way, same same uh, power V channel and everything as my professor, but uh, he gave he uh, sent me this superpower. You can see here, same same pocket style and everything. They're actually very similar sticks. They actually came out at the same time, but uh, same exact stick and all white. And all white is typically what I normally use, but I want to go a little something different and with the Maryland flag stick. So uh, really happy with this stick as well overnight to me. We actually had a small snafu in shipping uh, due to the hurricane on the East Coast. He ironed it out for me. So uh, as far as the quality of his sticks go, etc., they throw exactly like I want, consistent and accurate, which as an attackman you absolutely need. I pride myself as a feeding attackman, but I score when necessary. So my passes and stuff are absolutely accurate and, and my shooting is consistent as well. So those are the two things, if you're new to lacrosse, those are the two things you really want out of a stick. You want consistency and accuracy. You don't want a stick that has a raising whip and then sometimes it has a whip, sometimes it doesn't. You need it, if it's gonna have a whip, it's got to have a whip every time consistently how you throw it so you can adjust your, your throws to the, how, the, how the stick uh, acts in your hands. So uh, overnight, like I said, overnight this, uh, in the tournament they actually did let me use the professor which was fantastic, but just in case, I was uh, confident I had this backup. So if anybody has any questions by, as far as Burn by Lax's customer service, it's impeccable, quality of stringing is unbelievable, and uh, overall satisfaction. Uh, is through the moon. Uh, I've been recommending him to uh, the kids I coach and I've also uh, have mentioned to several family members and East Coast friends back East that if you are looking for a uh, somebody to string a high quality stick uh, for either you or your kids that uh, burn by lax. If you look him up on eBay or Facebook that uh, he does a very good job, a lot of quality and a lot of care goes into his stringing. So thank you very much.